have to go to the telephone. I know exactly where it is. It was right here. In the front. Right here, right? Or was it in the office? Yeah, right there. The thing. The thing. Fuck Jesus! Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of At Dead of Night. I am loving this game so much so far. It's a blast to play. It's so scary and so interactive. We figured out what happened to one of the ghosts. We are going to investigate what happened to Dr. Bowles right now. If you guys cool with that, you down with that? Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go! I didn't show much of this in the last episode, but basically this gives you hints on what to do next. So you see the dude with the big old six head. And you see this guy, like this dude wants the spotlight so bad, I'll give it to you my guy, but just let me know what you're about. Like, let me know if you're about that life. I need a hint right now. There's something going on with this table. Like, I swear to God, you want me to get my credit card and just chop up a couple lines? Like, I will if you want me to. And that's it? Yeah. Bro, what do you want me to do? Okay, I'm so confused. Let's go this way, go here. Um, I'm gonna go in here. Because that's where I know where the table is. That's about it. Like, right here. OH MY GOD! <laughs> Stupid bunny holding bitch? What was that about? Is it Dr. Bose? That's Dr. Bose. Okay, so that's why I needed to go in here. That hurt my neck. Yo, Doc, I need a neck massage, man. You did this to me. <laughs> Okay, um, we're gonna ask about you finding a dead animal, you stupid bitch. PUTA! I saw you holding up a dead animal on a wire. What had happened? Oh, fuck me, silly senpai. Jimmy was killing things, small birds, animals. I mean, that's the start of a serial killer, right? So I asked him to think of something nice he could do for me. Like what? I was surprised. He came up with an idea right away. What was that? Tell me, tell me, tell me. Dr. Bose, how are you gonna speak so cryptically? The of the stairs. Oh. What happened to her? What? I didn't click that. She fell down the stairs on the top floor. Oh, she very observant, Doc. She was doing. It was the reason Rose got in touch with me. Rose, who's Rose? Are you gonna ask for me? Ask for me. Okay, I guess she's not gonna ask for me. I Let's saw a ask about this. Book. With newspaper articles in it. Who made it? Jimmy made it. Jimmy. It was a warning. I should have seen it coming. Okay, which one should I do? Bloodstained Why cloth? Is there a blood-stained cloth in one of the drawers? It was mine. I kept it in case I needed it as evidence. Okay, Jimmy was killing things. I realized he needed to work on his empathy skills, so I asked him to think of something nice he could do for me. He came up with an idea right away. We don't know what the idea is, though. Um, how about... Wedding ring? Who did ring? the wedding ring belong to? I don't know. Okay, you don't know who that belonged to? What was the coil of wire used for? It belonged to Jimmy. He okay, what did he do with it? Okay, what is the nice thing that Jimmy did for the doctor? I found some trophies. That's what we gotta figure out, because we gotta pair it. I don't know. Dude, you don't know shit. You're so whack. What kind of doctor are you? I'm not even gonna call you doctor. Why is there an old heater marked dangerous? I don't know. Huh. I don't know. Yeah, of course, you never know. Washing line? Why was there a washing line tied around a rolling pin? Okay, I want to see if these two are linked. Jimmy drawing violent pictures and the idea that Jimmy came when up with. When you said Jimmy came up with an idea to do something nice for you, does that have anything to do with what you said about those violent pictures? Please yes, please yes, please yes. Damn it! You never know anything! Where did the wooden paddle come from? You used to spank him. I don't know, but Jimmy found it. Okay, I think I need to find another item. Because this dude don't know shit about anything. What about the chef hat? Who did the chef's hat belong to? Did Jimmy cook you a five star? Jimmy found it and put it on. 
All right. So what I did was Jimmy found the chef's hat and put it on, and also Jimmy was killing things, so the doctor wanted him to do something nice for him. Maybe he tried to cook when a meal. When you said Jimmy came up with an idea to do something nice for you, is that connected to what you said about the chef's hat? Please, 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 please. Yes! Yes! Go! Okay, I know exactly where that is. I think on the first floor there's a kitchen. So we gotta go downstairs. We gotta see what's cooking good looking. Yep, we gotta go to G, cause I'm a G. All right, so that scared the shit out of me. Dude, we gotta make sure Yimmy's not here. Yimbo? Yimmer? Okay, we're good. We're good, okay, click this. We gotta go. He can pop up wherever, whenever, however, do it any style that he likes. And yeah, I thought he was gonna be there. I low-key thought he was gonna be there. He does give you hints from time to time. Like he'll make some noises. He'll be like, where are you? Well, not really, he won't say that. But he will kind of like give you hints. He'll like uh, make some like Texas two steps. He'll make a lot of noise, cause a ruckus. Can I stop turning? That's the one thing I don't like about this, how sensitive the turning is. And I think the kitchen is all the way over here. No, too dark ahead. What's this spot? Uh, where's the kitchen at? Hold on. Hold on, ladies and gentlemen. I'm confused. I think it might be here. Let's make a little right. Yeah, here we go. Okay, right here. Right here, right here. Give me some of this. Yeah, buddy. Come on, show me something. This is the kitchen, dude! Can I talk to you here? Is anyone there? Dude, my voice cracked so hard. Uh, oh my! This is a great idea, Jimmy. I reckon you'll make a great cook one day. <sighs> uh, why don't you bring it up to me when you're done? Doctor Bose, bro. Okay. Doctor Bose. See, this is why I only fuck with Dre beats, cause Bose stay messing up. This is so ridiculous. Okay, turn this on. Let's get connected, man. Is it Doctor Bose? Let's get connected. Come on, I really want to know if we got a connection. Vaguely heard. What? Hold on. Give me one second. It's gotta be right here. Is it Dr. Bose? I can't believe, like, from room to room, it's like that. Are you Dr. Bose? Yes, we know you're Dr. Bose. Let's ask about Dr. Bose outside of the I kitchen. I saw you outside the kitchen talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? Jimmy was making me a sandwich. Oh, you said get in the kitchen made me that fucking sandwich, out. boy. I didn't suspect. Okay. He was making a sandwich. He brought it up to my room as I asked. I didn't suspect anything was wrong at first. So something was wrong eventually. What would that be though? I found a bottle of turpentine. Maybe he put the turpentine and lighter in what there. What were they for? Don't say I don't know. Don't say I don't know. Ooh. Okay, so Jimmy was making me a sandwich. He brought it up to my room as I asked. I didn't suspect anything was wrong at first, and then maybe it's linked with a turpentine. When you said you didn't suspect anything was wrong, does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? Please, yes, please, yes, please, yes, please, yes. Uh, okay. Um, I don't know what to pair this with. Hold on. Let me think. Let's see the connections. Um. Everybody, I'm trying to big brain it right now. What would be inside of a sandwich? It's got to be like some kind of poison, right? Or maybe it was this. When you said you didn't suspect anything was wrong, does that maybe he was coughing to do up blood, blood and then, like spit it into the cloth? Please tell me. It was my first encounter with Jimmy's Thank you. All right, guys, we are nailing this. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, we are killing it. So we gotta go to the first floor. And he's hammering something. We have to go... Oh, we also have to go to floor three? Shoot! Okay, so let's go to floor one first. Then we're gonna go to floor three. Please, Jimmy, don't be here. I don't think he can come here. But we'll see. I don't know. I'm assuming that he doesn't come onto the ground floor. But I don't want to, like, say things and then I'm completely off my guard. And then he's just randomly here and then I'm dead. So let's just assume that he goes everywhere. He can go on ground floor, the below ground floor, first floor, second floor, third floor, all that. So let's see. Jimmy? 
Jimmer! Better not be here. Okay. I'm gonna go in 113. Oh, dude, it's so freaking dark. Okay, let me use the scrying mirror just so we can get a little hint. And also so I can stop sweating my balls off. Holy crap. It is so wet under here. Dr. Bose is freaky, though. Oh, God, Dr. Bose is so scary. <laughs> What is that? Oh, I gotta go in the bathroom? That's all the way in the beginning! So, the good doctor is inside of the bathroom, taking the biggest, fattest chimichanga shit this side known to man. Then we gotta go to floor three, and we gotta get Liddy on my titties. And he's waiting for me. Okay, so we gotta go to the bathroom, then we gotta go to the third floor. Let's freaking get it, ladies and gentlemen. But before we do that, let's see. Come on. Give me some, Jimmy. Oh my god. Okay. I swear he lets out a little fart at the end. God damn it. I don't know what he's saying, but he's freaking me out. He's close. He's close, he's close. He came by again? Okay, so once I get out, make a right. Once you get out, Jay, make a right, okay? Give it five seconds. One, two, three, Four, five, let's go. Back out. Go, 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 go. Holy crap, I'm backing away from my screen. I'm so freaked out. Okay, this way. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay, come on, 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 come on. Holy crap, where the hell? Oh my god, no! Oh shit. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh, please, 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 please. Oh my god. I am got goosebumps. I am got goosebumps. Shit. Go this way. This way. No, 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 no. Go! God damn! Please! Go! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I am got goosebumps, man. Wow. What is wrong with me? Okay. This way, this way, this way. Come on. This way? Holy crap. Oh my god. Where the hell am I? Dude, no! Oh. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Tell my mom I love her. Tell my mom I love her. Oh crap, he's right there. He's right there. Everybody, I don't even know where I'm going right now. This is bullshit. Okay. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Wait, wrong way. Wrong way. This way. This way. Right here. He's in the bathroom. Yes. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Okay, I mean, not thank you. This dude is literally dying in front of my eyes. Wait, I didn't mean to press that. Oh, Jimmy, look what you did, Jimmy. Look what you did, bud. Okay, is let's talk Dr. to Dr. Bose. Bose. That was so crazy, man. I hate when he chases me. This game shouldn't be this scary. Like, it should not be this frightening. Let's ask about you spitting out blood. I saw you spitting out blood. What happened? The old broken glass and sandwich trick. <laughs> what a child. Okay, so you had to step up his treatment urgently. What did you do? Did you spank him? When you said you needed to step up see. Jimmy's treatment Maybe urgently. spank him, that's treatment. Is that connected to what you said about the wooden paddle? I don't know, I'm just guessing right now. He's probably gonna say I don't know. Of course you don't know. Of course you don't freaking know. You know what? I think I gotta come back because I remember the vision said that I had to go to the third floor as well. Please don't be here. Okay. Oh god. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Turn. Go to the third floor. Right now. Right now. I am clenching my butt cheeks so hard. Okay. Floor three. Woo! All right. I don't know how fast Jimmy can come up the stairs. Because he's on the first floor, it's gonna take him some time to go to the third floor, but how long? Who knows? Find out on this episode of Girly Man Screams, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, wait. This side was dark before. Now it's Lydia on my titties. Okay, that's good. That's what I like to see. Kinda. Let's go inside 302. What'd it do? Oh, uh, no! Okay, actually, get out, please. Por favor. Muy bien, gracias. Go this way. Please. Please don't be here. 
Oh lord, this is so scary. I hate the turns, everybody. It just gives you so much anxiety. Oh, what was that? Why was that light flickering like Nosferatu, man? Stop doing this to me. Move into room. Let's do a little bit of this. Um, you found a handwritten note which reads, Goodbye. Not very good either. Terrible handwriting. Terrible penmanship. This is the same thing? Wait, double shits? Wait, how are you gonna have double shits? That's random. Okay, let me look through the glass. Hmm. I hear like faint screaming. I don't know what to do. What should I do? Like, what should I really do? If you hear screaming, do you just go? I think we just go, man. I think we just wing it. We just wing it. All right, come on. Don't get scared, don't get scared. Whew. I think it's this room. That ain't it. Every time a door doesn't work, I get- Ah, so scared, what the? I'm telling you, he's been lying about everything, probably lying about the other stuff as well. These cutscenes, they trigger so effortlessly. It creeps me out. He lies about everything. Open your bloody eyes, Rose. Oh, that's right, walk off. I'm not listening, Harley. So this is gonna be a new ghost. It's the truth. Oh, okay. Hold on. Go inside here. You noted the man saying Jimmy lied. Okay, let's turn this on. Let's see who's, who's in that? this room. Hey, who's this? What's your name? Okay, we got a new character unlocked. Harvey. Harvey. Run the place. You run the place. Okay. Um. Who wrote this? the note that says goodbye? I don't know. You don't know. You don't know who wrote the goodbye. Why is there huh? an old what heater marked dangerous? dangerous? Heater? He's getting electric shock. Oh, I kept it so the police could check it. Wait, the old heater was giving electric shocks. I kept it so the police could check it. Do you think that the doctor was giving Jimmy electric shock treatment? I don't know. Who did the wedding Let's ask ring about the wedding to? ring. Maybe that was his wifey. Probably belongs to Rose. Rose. Okay, it's a pretty name. I saw some suitcases in a chest. Who did they belong to? Rose. But she never used them. Okay. Trophies? I found some trophies. Who won them? I don't know anything about that. You don't know that? Where did the wooden paddle come from? It was always under the counter in reception. It was always under the counter in the reception. You don't know where it came from. That sounds like a bag of cap. I saw a man saying Jimmy had lied about the assault. Who was he? That was you. It was me. Jimmy had made accusations about the doctor. Okay. So let me see, let me see, let me see. I saw Dr. Bow spitting out blood. What happened? He doesn't know. He learned about Jimmy the hard way. Jimmy's pranks always went too far. I don't think that's a prank. Like, you're just trying to kill somebody at that point. I don't know what to say. I'm gonna back out of here and I'm going to look through the glass. Because I don't think I have enough evidence. Go here. Go here. Oh. oh my god! Okay. Go here, go here, go here, go here. Hurry up. Shit. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. He's gonna find me. I should have just kept going. I should have went around. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh my god. Oh. I can't believe he found out where it was. He's so smart. Dude, he's so smart. Actually, he's not that smart. Because if he was smart, he would look in here right now. This sideshow Bob looking dude with uh, nothing on the top. I can't believe it. Unless he's waiting for me. Imagine though. Okay. Okay, I think we're good. Please tell me he left. God. Let's check. One more time for the homie DJ Screw. I really don't know. We're just gonna take a chance. We're gonna take a chance one time. Okay? Please, Jimmy, don't move. Okay. This way. Oh, he's right there. Okay, we're going this way. We're going this way. Go inside of this room, 301. Yeah. Okay, move into room. 
broke in here. Yes! You found some broken wall mirrors. Okay, what the hell does that mean? I don't know what it means, but maybe I can ask the good doctor about it. Hello, doctor. Don't tell me. Oh! Yep. I'm dead. I'm dead. Please don't. Please don't. That is so freaking creepy. I think I'm screwed. He's just gonna stay there. He knows I'm in here. You know what? Let me go inside the bathroom. Please. What if he's in here? Oh my god. Dude, I hate when they turn around so freaking fast in this game. So stupid. Come on, Jimmy. Leave me alone, bro. Just let me do my thing, man. Let my dick swing one time, man. Why you just gotta keep me like this? I don't know, but... Uh oh Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> I'm so screwed. I think I'm so screwed. <laughs> Please. Should I just try? I'm gonna try. I'm gonna do it. Please, please, please. Okay, we're gonna go outside. Oh, God. Look through one time. He's close. There's no way. I think I see his head on the side of the glass. Is that him? That don't look like him. Actually, I'm not sure. Dude, the wind is so nasty and loud. It's nasty like Jimmy's mom. Okay. You know what? I gotta stop being a little bitch. I just gotta do it. I gotta stop being like this. I gotta stop being like this. Let's go. Let's go. Stop playing with me, Jimmy! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Stop playing with me, Jimmy. Stop playing with me, dog. Okay. Whew. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get me back to the elevator, please. Get me back to the elevator. Where the hell's the elevator? This is the wrong place. Oh no. Jimmy, don't do this to me, dude. Here? I'm screwed, I'm so screwed, I'm so screwed. Okay. Right here, right here! Oh! What if I just go? What if I just go? Go, 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 please, please, please! Please, please! I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go! Come on. First floor, first floor. Woo! Bitch! Go! Oh my god! Okay, my hands are so sweaty. I wish you guys could see the sweat on my hands. We're gonna figure out this story with Dr. Bose, okay? Now, I'm not gonna end this episode until we do. Because I'm about that life. I'm about it. You guys already know I'm about it. Okay, go back inside of the bathroom. And then we talk to the doctor. Hello? And let's ask him about the broken mirrors. Hello? Hello? Is it Dr. Bose? Yes. Hmm. Yeah. Let's ask about the broken How mirror. did those mirrors get broken? Please tell me. I didn't see them. What? Okay, so you don't know about the broken mirrors. I'm gonna look at the scrying mirror. Because I swear that I am doing something wrong. I mean, I obviously am, but I feel too stupid to connect this pair for some reason. So we got bowling ball head ass. We got upside down bowling ball head ass. We got Dr. Bowles headphone wearing ass. We got 123. Okay, 123. And we're gonna find out more about, is that Dr. Bowles? Or is that Harv? That's my guy Harvey Dent? What was he yawning for? Bitch about to make me yawn. Okay. Uh, what the hell is that about? What the heck? Oh, it looks like something's so, like, sewn shut. And then also we gotta go to third floor. Does that mean Jimmy's on third floor? I think that's the scrying mirror telling us that Jimmy is on the third floor. Hopefully. So we gotta go to room 123. Okay, this is room 117. This is room 116. Okay. Where's 123 at? 118. This is 119. And then 
120. Okay. What about here? 114? Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Maybe 120's here? In the corner? 121? Yay! Okay, 123. So, there's probably either gonna be something here or there's gonna be like a cutscene. So, everybody, pay attention. I already have a compass. Oh, there we go. You found a syringe and a bottle of diazepam medicine. Did I say that right? Diazepam? I'm pretty sure I did. I'm not a doctor, man. I'm not Dr. Bose. Come on, Jimmy. Make my day. Okay, he's making my day. That's cute. I better have the diazepam if you kill me. I don't hear him, though. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. Like, we're trying to figure out the story. It's a beautiful story. It's a dark and twisted and sad story. I'm gonna figure it out. Come on. Let's go. I ain't scared. I'm not scared of you. I'm not scared of you! Go, 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 go. Wait, wrong way. What? Where's the exit? Oh shit. Okay. Right here. Give me that. Give me some. You guys saw me one take J that? Hello. Like, I'm out here big balling it, man. I got stones. Okay, let's ask about this after Is it we Dr. ask Bose? Dr. Bose. Yes, it's me. Yes, it's me. Here, <laughs> here, here. Where That's did the bottle the of diazepam pound. come from? It's been held to treat impulsive behavior in some people. Well, I don't like that very much, Dr. Bose. So we're going to talk about it. We are going to pair when this. When you said you needed to step sure up Jimmy's treatment urgently. Because we got that, that vision from the Does that have something to do with what you said about the diazepam? It wasn't the ideal medication, but it was all that I had. It was all he had, he says. He was a tapper, he says. Dangerous, but I mean, I think you made him even more dangerous because I'm pretty sure that you're dead. You're a ghost, and he's still alive. So I mean, who took the dub there? You tell me. Let's turn this off and let's figure some things out. Where are we gonna go? Where are we gonna go? I hate the stairway animation, man. Shit, it's too creepy. <laughs> Ew, it's so creepy. Okay, turn around. Oh my God! Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> We're not doing that. We don't do that here. Leave. Gee, leave! Why am I going down here? I'm dead. Jimmy, go ahead and clap. Go ahead and clap. Give me the clapper. Give me the 2 a.m. clapper right now, Jimmy. Oh, God. Okay, reverse psychology. Open that. And where the hell am I going? I don't know where I'm going. I'm just gonna try to figure it out. So he's on the first floor. We know that for damn sure. So we're gonna throw him off. And we're gonna go to the second floor. Ah! 211 and 210, right? Wait, was he behind me? Bro, he was right there. Shit, run, 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 run. Go in here, hide in here. This freaking guy. I saw him hiding right there on the right. Okay, look through the glass. What the heck? Oh, yep, I'm dead. Hide in the bathroom. God damn. I can't believe he was right there. I'm so annoying. Please, dude, please, dude. I can't believe he doesn't see you. This is ridiculous, man. He's ridiculous in a good way. Hmm. Okay, he closed the door. What if he can close the door, but he never actually leaves? Imagine? That'd be so scary. Okay. Glass. Okay, I don't hear him anymore. So let's go. We gotta go between 211 and 210. We gotta trigger something. 211 and 210. Is it here? 211 and 210? Hello? 206. What's over here? 27 or 207? 209? Uh, 211 and 210. There he is. This won't hurt Jimmy. I knew I was gonna All you have to it do is stand hallway, still so and stop his moving ass. around. Okay. Oh crap. 
Is it Dr. Bose? Hello, Doctor. Is it Dr. Bose? I can't ask him anything. Who is it? What? Okay, so maybe this ain't it? The heck? Can we go inside here? He's in one of the rooms, he's gotta be. Is it Dr. Bose? Come on, Doctor! Here. Hey. Oh god, why did I do that? Is it Dr. Bose? Oh, I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. Oh crap. Okay, go here. Oh crap, why did I do that? I'm an idiot. Is it Dr. Bose? I was trying to ask if he was there, but I actually called out to Jimmy. I'm sorry, everybody. There you go. Okay, let's talk I about saw this. you with a needle talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? So frightened. My legs are shaking. Jimmy right now. let me administer the drug. I had to chase him around the hotel. Then he told Rose I tried to force him to take it. That I'd used violence. It was ridiculous. So I picked the broken mirrors, and then Jimmy refused to let me administer the drug, and then he said that he. Uh, when did you violence. said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine, is that connected to what you said about the broken mirrors? Please, yes. Please, yes. So that means I need to find something. I need to find something connected to there. Oh crap. Maybe there's something here. Please? Oh! You found a poster for Jimmy Hall's comedy act? Ain't nobody give a damn about his comedy act! Oh shit! Bro, somebody got the strap! Somebody better scrap that da! Somebody really loading up 9mm bullets. Let me ask about Who the handgun. Who does the gun belong to? Okay, so Dr. Bose injected with needle, and then we are going to show the little spanky paddle, which is right here. When you said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine, is that connected to what you said about the wooden paddle? Oh, little wooden spanking. Jimmy said I used the paddle to beat him. I would never use violence against a patient. It was ridiculous. Well, obviously, a mother would believe their son, especially when it comes to violence. Come on now. That's just parenting 101. We're always gonna believe our child. Okay, so somebody's dialing something. That's the phone downstairs. So we have to go to the telephone. I know exactly where it is. It was right here in the front. Right here, right? Or was it in the office? Yeah, right there. The thing, the thing. Ah, oh, Jesus! Never use force like that on a patient, Mrs. Hall. It goes against Fuck everything you. I believe in. You have to understand, he's making it all up. Ay, ay, ay. I. Okay, I expected the last one, but for some reason, I didn't think that it was gonna be in the office, but I decided to check. So let's Is go to ask Bose? who's there. Ugh, these hurt. Yes. Alright. What happened when you were explaining what I saw happened? you trying to explain what happened with Jimmy. You seem desperate. Yeah, you seem desperate, man. You desperate. It's not a good look. I was not even a lie. Would believe Jimmy. It was a bare-faced lie. But I managed to convince Rose Jimmy was making it up. Oh, cool. We didn't actually have to pair anything else. So we gotta go to the second floor. NHS? Second floor NHS. I have no idea what that means. But we are gonna go here one time. Hold on, I'm gonna pause this real quick because your boy needs to go pee pee. All right, your boy is back. We are ready to do this. Floor number two, what it do, baby girl. Okay, that pee kind of rejuvenated me, you know? Little tinkle, give him that little twinkle in my eye. I don't even know why I said that. That's the dumbest shit I ever freaking said. I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry about that. But, let's go. I'm not sorry about what I'm about to do to this game. You know? I'm about to go kapow! Kapow, bitch! Oh, shit! Okay. Well, we're not doing that. We're gonna go this way. Uh, and then we're gonna do a little bit of this. You know, you know what I'm saying? A little bit of that. Hide in here. 
because I'm a freaking puss. And oh, sorry. So sensitive. This game's so sensitive, like me sometimes. You know, when I watch a sad movie, when I watch The Lion King, Simba. Your kingdom is wherever the light touches. I, I don't even know. I know we're supposed to be on the second floor. I don't hear Jimmy doing his little tiptoes. So we're gonna look at the scrying mirror one time. If you all think that I'm cheating by using the scrying mirror, you're damn right. You're damn right I am. What you gonna do about it, huh? You gonna come say it to my face? If you do, please be kind about it. Like I said, I'm sensitive. I'm a sensitive person. So I've seen that before. 216 and then there's like three mannequins. I remember I mentioned something about those mannequins. Okay, and then Dr. Bose, don't yawn. Is that Harvey? Oh, he's doing the yawn again. Nah, I'm not gonna yawn this time. I am not gonna give in to the peer pressure. And then what's this thing? It looks like a spiral notebook and it also looks like a bed is sewn shut. And it also looks like the scrapbook. The scrapbook. Okay, number three, Jimmy's there. So does that mean he's gone? I saw him turn the corner. Like you can't cap me. I saw him, but let's look through here. Jimmy. Okay, I don't hear anything. I don't hear anything. I don't think he's here. He's got to be on the third floor. I think that's what it means. When it shows, like, the floor, and then it says where they are, I think he is um, somewhere else. There you go. Right here. 216. Wait. 216? Yes! Give me that 216, baby! Hell yeah! Okay. So check here. Inside here. Heck. Uh. Doc? What the? Hold on. What's in here? Hello? Who's here? Oh, uh, what? Hold on. You in here? You said 216. You lied! <gasps> oh shit. You can't get away from me that oh, easily, damn. Jimmy. Why don't you start bed, again, don't you? Spread leg and everything. Why don't you do what I asked you to do this time? That would be a good start, wouldn't it? What that sound disturbing? That was kinda weird, right? Dude, what the hell? Is it Dr. Bose? That was pretty weird. What the hell were you doing on that bed? I saw you sitting on a bed talking weird. to Jimmy. What were you doing? Yeah, what were you doing, huh? Creepy ass. I thought when he realized he'd been caught lying, he'd start to engage with me and do what I asked. Ew, what? Instead, he just made up another lie. Only this one Why does Dr. Bowles sound a little creepy? The worst. Okay, let's do that. Scrapbook. And then we're going to do this. You said Jimmy That's made it. up another lie I remember lie it was in the you. vision. A much worse lie. Does that have something to do with what you said about the scrapbook? Yeah. Jimmy accused me of the worst crime possible. All right, Talk ladies and gentlemen, we are doing so trend. good right now. It was me. It so was good. Me. I hope you all are proud of me. Because we are dodging Jimmy like Neo from the Matrix. So we need to go to the first floor because I see police sirens. We're going to wing it. Every time I've been winging it in this game, we have greatness. Right? <gasps> oh, shit. Okay. Go here. And then look through one time. I know he knows I'm here. Right? Does he? Yep. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. Hide in the bathroom. I knew that he saw me go inside there, so, you know. I kind of want him to be here so I know that he's around me, so I'm way more cautious. Because my play style is pretty reckless. Shut up! I'm trying to talk to the people, okay? Yeah, get out of here. So yeah, I'm kind of reckless, but it's been working out in our favor. And I say our favor because it's not just me. Like, we're in this together. So let's see. Please tell me. Please tell me this dude is gone yes all right yeah 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 i heard it before so whenever i hear him talking that bull i usually just wait like 
20 seconds, and then I start making my way downtown. Bases pass, and I'm homebound, you know? I've literally been going back and forth with him for probably 12 minutes now. So if he gets me, then he gets me. If I die, I die. Yep. There we go. Get on the ground floor. I can't believe I escaped that. Whew. In here. Ground floor, baby. Thank you. I can't believe I got away with that. I am either the luckiest person ever, or I have just mastered Jimmy right now. Okay, let's rub the palm for good luck. Ooh. Okay, somebody's knocking. Where's that at? Where's that at? Sounds like it's right here. Right here, right? Oh shit. Where? Um. Hold on, I'm coming. What the heck? Hold on. Me off. <laughs> These like scary jump scares. I mean scary jump scares. What are they? Funny jump scares? That's what happens when I'm scared. I start saying nonsensical Is it things. Dr. Bose? I'm a nonsensical person. Yes, it's me. Yes, it's me. <laughs> I saw you upset and heard the police banging on the door. What was going on? Rose reported me. I knew they'd strike me off. I had no career, no future. I decided to take control once and for all. Oh, I think I know what it is. This one and the gun. When you said you decided to take control once and for all, does that have something to do with what you said about the gun? Maybe. I don't know. Mm, how about... Shoot. What else? I found items, huh? Can't use the thing to pair that with. What else do we have? Washing line? When you said you decided to take control once and for all, does that have anything to do with what you said about the washing line and rolling pin? I experimented with the washing line, but it was Oh, dirty. dude. I found some That's ropes. disturbing. That's disturbing. I my keys to the hotel, so I crept in one oh, that gave me the chills. Oh, that gave me the chills. Okay, so that's the elevator. LG. Okay. Okay, go to the bottom floor. Ugh. So he tried to hang himself? Where, in the game room? Let's go downstairs. We gotta go to LG. Dude, the story of this game is so interesting, but it's so creepy. It, it, like, it hits different than a regular scary game. And I like that you don't just find notes like every horror game out there. Or it's like you read the backstory and like you learn about the characters. You actually learn about them through this. Oh shit. Oh crap. Oh, I thought I heard somebody. Okay. Let's go here. Let's just try random things. Can't do that. Can't go in there. Where you at, doctor? Where you at, good doctor? Huh? Doc? I'm expecting Doc. There he is. Shit, dude. This story is insane, bro. Dude! Fuck that! That is so ridiculous. That is so unsettling. Okay. Let's do this. Is it Dr. Bose? Ugh! They gave me the heebie jeebies. I'm Dr. Bose, yes. I saw you tying a rope around your neck. You killed yourself. Why? Back. My life was over anyway. This game 
is so disturbing. What a sad ending. Both of them are sad. Him and the little girls. Wait, I know where that is. That's uh, on the ground floor. Okay. So you completed Dr. Bose's story. Okay, so what we're gonna do... I'm gonna go to the ground floor real quick. And maybe I'll end this episode without any deaths? That's gonna be cool. Like if I can do that? But damn. He tied the rope to the bottom of the elevator and then pressed it to go up? Or was it already up? Actually, I don't even know. Who cares? It's just so disturbing and sad. But we're gonna see what's inside of... Wait, why did I go here? No. We're going to ground floor. Yeah, I'm gonna go inside of the ballroom. Let me see what we can see over there before I end this episode because I'm so curious. This game's so freaking good. It's stupid good. It's ridiculously good. Shout out to Don Plays and John Wolf, man. They always find the hits. They always find the latest, greatest hits. So the vision was here. Right in here. Right? Let's see. There we go. Sweet. Behold! I am the great Hugo! Hugo? I stand alone above all others. I am the light which illuminates the darkness. I alone am the master. This is sprinkling nut dust all over my face and I think I like it. Why though? Who's man's for real though? Oh, that's interesting. Why did I pass out? Okay, let's open this back up. Let's see who's there. Is anyone there? Nope. Okay. Um, let's go here. Then maybe the dude is back here. Hugo, right? Hugo! Is someone there? Nope. Okay. I guess Hugo's not there? here. Yep. Alright. So, what we are going to do... We are going to end this episode here, everybody. And if you want to see more, because I know you want to see more, because I actually want to see more, make sure you leave a like on this video and let me know that you want more. We didn't die once this whole playthrough, so I think this video deserves a like just for that. Hopefully you enjoyed and want to see the next part. If you did, make sure you give this video one big fat like. That's all, friend, today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!